My name is Josh Wald, and I am a Talmud of Yeshivat Reshit Yerushalayim. My name is Ben Blumenthal, and I'm a Talmud of Yeshivat Reshit Yerushalayim. My name is Josh Smilo. My name is Ben Hoffer. I'm Daniel Hill, and I am a Talmud of Yeshivat Reshit Yerushalayim. A Talmud of Yeshivat Reshit Yerushalayim. And I'm a Talmud of Yeshivat Reshit Yerushalayim. I remember one day in Shir, Rav Eli was talking about how Reshit started. Sitting there in the base medrash and in the library and just seeing everybody around, you look up at this building and all the people in it and you really appreciate what it is for a family to have a vision and to make it happen and become a reality. It's crazy to think back to 25 years ago, first year Reshit Yerushalayim. Spending a year in the old city was one of the most impactful years of my life. Although it only was one year, it was an experience that will last me a lifetime. It completely changed the trajectory of my life in Torah, in Avodos Hashem, in davening, and how I view the world and my goals and my priorities. As Ravelli always says, it really does affect who you marry, how your children turn out, where you decide to settle, and it's something that I'm very grateful for. Everything that I have done in my life with my family and my wife, I really owe to the Marcuses and Yeshiva Reishit Yerushalayim. From the very beginning, Reishit for me has been a family and immediately I felt like I was a part of something. I think something that makes Reishit unique was how relatable the Rebbeim were and how they always made an effort to relate to us wherever we were holding in life. No question was too silly, no thought was too crazy. When I'm developing the kind of educator that I wanted to become and the type of Rebbe that I wanted to be, the modeling that the Rebbeim had, Ravari, Ravelli, Ravdani, all of them, what they gave me in terms of what it means to be a Rebbe, how to care about a Talmud, and how to be an educator, it shaped me more than any graduate school and any course that I could have possibly taken along the way. That fire and that passion that I was given 25 years ago, I try to share that every single day with my Talmudim. I now work as an attorney, and I've learned that when you go into the business world, it's not like you leave your religious life at home. You're not one person at work and one person when you come home to your family and your community. I really learned that back in Reshit, that you take every part of you, you take the Ben HaYeshiva, and you take the Balabas, and you put them together to bring this one person who's going to be the most productive person both at work and at home. Behold Rachecha Da'ehu, that through all of what you're doing, wherever you may find yourself, and really seeing whatever occupation you may find yourself, or whatever place, as a way of being an Evid Hashem, that's really what's important. And it's not necessarily learning all day, every day, which is what we do in Yeshiva, but really giving us a path, path of integrity to live with through the rest of our lives. I think that more than any of the Torah that I learned at Reshit, that lesson has really helped keep spirituality in my daily life. There's never a dull moment, whether it's having Sfarim here in my office, my Chavrus that I have with Ravelli on Friday mornings, speaking to Rav Landau over the phone. That's something that they ingrained in us that no matter what is going on in our lives, never just to sit and be idle, always just to try and learn. 20 years later, after my Shana Aleph, we're going strong. It may have been 25 years ago, but it certainly set the trajectory for my life. And to think about thousands of Talmidim that have walked through those doors and have been impacted by those walls of that yeshiva is a staggering thought. When I think of 25 years, I think of the countless young men who've had their lives transformed. I'm just one. And I know that my wife, my children, the home I've built would not be the home it is without the influence that Rachel was in my life.